Hello Capricorn, this is your reading for June 1st through 15th. This is Amber with Labs and Sync Tarot. I do want to thank you so much for being here. I also want to say uh, a little bit about the month of June. So the month of June is a six and uh, Six is about others, others' needs, um, your communication with others, your partnerships, your relationships. They're all going to be under scrutiny at this time. So um, it's going to seem like things are out of whack when it comes to relationships, but they're all going to come together, so I wouldn't worry about it. Um... Yeah, that's about it. Okay, we'll get started. You had two cards fall out. You had the Eight of Swords fall out and the Ten of Cups in reverse. Okay. And that is a reminder that you are stuck or restricted in something. Like, you can't make a decision. Your thoughts are really going wild. And your thoughts are delaying you from your goals of happiness. You're looking to be happy. And I feel like you think it's a specific person or specific situation that you need to get in. But really, it's just about emotions and, and, and letting others in or, or um, letting other opportunities in. And you're not allowing that to happen because you're focused on one thing. Okay. You have the sun in reverse. The sun in reverse is a reminder that everything is okay. It's just like right now, it's just a deep down, just a, a bad situation just at the moment, like a temporary brief of depression or a temporary lack of success. Exactly. Destiny. Because your destiny is here. Things are changing so things can get better. Okay, things cannot always stay the same. Things have to change. And sometimes it, it doesn't feel like you're in control and that is a horrible feeling but sometimes you just have to let divine energy in the universe take control so so things can happen the way that it's supposed to for your greater good for others or dealing with others partnerships relationships friendships you have the seven of cups which is daydreams and decisions this is a reminder to stay out of your mind to stay out of illusion to stay out of fantasy and to see truth um, there are too many choices maybe you're unclear on decisions because there's too much stuff going on okay within your emotion sector when it has to do with other people and you need to remember to remain to remain to I'm sorry to remember to remain clear there we go for your career you have environmentalists you're an earth angel who has to protect nurture and teach about nature and other and the animals okay so I really feel like this is about getting out in nature trying something new um, meeting other people. Being open to the possibilities. But being very cautious and caring of others, the universe, animals, things like that. In your relationship, you have getting to know each other. As you reveal your innermost selves to each other, your bond deepens. Okay, so there's uh, this, there's someone that you have been connecting with. Um, I feel like on and off. And, uh, okay, so this is a time of strengthening relationships with others. And this is not just in romantic ways. I feel in all ways. You need to get to know people better. Um, I feel like you're going through a time of um, I just want to be by myself type of I need to think. Um, but this is a time to to open up to people, to get to know them. They might have or do something that could be of assistance to you, okay? Especially in the romance department. So just keep that open. There's nothing the matter with being alone, but just remember to um, get out and express yourself. 
Surrender to play. Take a break from overthinking. A goal. Do something fun. Play is a time of recreation and rejuvenation. Definitely, definitely, definitely. You need to get out, Capricorn. This month you need to get out. You need to make some 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 bonds with some people. You need to talk to some people. You need to you need to get out there, okay? Make some plays as the kids say these days. Um destiny because it's all your destiny. It just seems like things are not going well, but really they are. It's just about your mindset. So spirit or your higher self would like you to know at this time friendship. I understand that a friend and I have a friend in my life for a reason. Friends, spend time with your friends, get out with your friends. There are friends that you're missing or friends that you're not paying attention to. Rekindle with those people. They may have something for you or bring something into your life. Okay. So I already shuffled and meditated over the cards. That's why I had the two other cards fall out of the deck. Um, if you order a reading from me, this will be considered the full spread reading. You have the Ace of Pentacles in reverse, the Ace of Swords, Ace of Cups in reverse. Wow. Eight of Pentacles. I'm telling you right now, you got three Aces in a reading. That means that you're in a transition, most definitely. This is a month of, of needing to get things done, okay? The world card, justice, look at all these major arcanas. Nine of cups, six of wands in reverse, five of cups, four of pentacles. I love to see that in a Capricorn reading. Maybe, we'll see. Nine of pentacles in reverse. Uh, the last reading I just did got that as well and the overall and it was the Aries if you have any Aries in your chart I will go look at the Aries reading okay Capricorn so nine of Pentacles you have nine of Pentacles in reverse that means that there is something that you are not paying attention to in your life that you need to in order to become more self-reliant okay you may be having some difficulties it's time for you to chop it up and move forward Okay. It's like you have lack of faith or a lack of motivation and you need to realize that you need to be clear thinking. There are things that you need to do. There are things that you need to handle. There also may be an air sign that's out there to help you. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. I really don't think that, but Spirit told me to say it because it's probably one person who does. Okay, and exactly. <laughs> so you have a message coming in possibly from an air sign or some sort of communication coming in and you need to be aware to actually see it if you don't see it you're going to miss out on the opportunity okay it's like it's giving you direction where you didn't have any direction you were so worried you didn't know where to go and you're about to be released from all those worries look all those swords you're about to be released from all those swords okay so in the past you had the ace of cups in reverse you were working on a relationship or some sort of love and it just didn't work out it just didn't work out exactly worried worried thinking about the past but you have to realize that this heartbreak and this separation was it was just the way it was supposed to go right now you're not going to understand it and when i get the will of fortune i stop pulling cards because it's not for me to understand it, it's like to me it's like the universe or spirit telling me you need to stop right here because this is all you need to know so all you need to know is that there the separation was for a reason and you are worried about it or it's something that sticks with you you have the ace of pentacles going on now so there's some sort of situation in your stability whether you lost a job or a home or um you're looking for a new home you're having trouble focusing on on thinking on the things that um help stabilize you like your pentacle energy okay and something needs to come to an end and you need to start looking you need to start looking okay um, because you're about to get separated from something maybe a partnership a roommate uh something there's something that's breaking up and you need to start looking okay the thing is you don't have any clarity your challenge is trying to to figure out or have clear thinking on where to go or what to do 
Yeah. Um, having clear thinking on what to do with the, with this it means like there's delays and frustration you got scattered energy you don't know what to do okay you don't know what to do you're thinking about what you did in the past maybe someone can help you in the past but with this it's it's more unrealistic like no one is going to help you okay page of wands in reverse i mean page of swords in reverse i'm sorry it means that maybe someone offered to help you and it fell through or maybe you feel you got let down by an air sign gemini libra or aquarius and it's time for you to make some real judgments about what to do okay um maybe you need to think about other friends that can help you okay that can stop your world from falling apart okay um i'm also hearing for some of you you need to stop partying yeah you need to stop partying and focus on your needs you feel left out in the cold and you're trying to you're trying to break through this pessimism that you have about things not working out and take the steps forward you're being methodical and you're really trying to think about what to do because you don't want to be in a situation that that you can't be released from so in the near future you have the eight of pentacles in reverse and things fail to pay off or you're being impatient it seems like you're that things aren't working now even though you're trying to work things out um the thing is you're being you're not being smart um not being, I don't want to say that, but there's a block because of your friends or trying to have fun. Um, and there's, but there's a need for you to, to really pay attention. You have a fear of losing or a fear of not uh, you need to ask for help you have a fear of your friends turning you down or people seeing you fail but you're gonna get some bad news or or things are approaching quickly and you're gonna need to do that you're gonna need to get some assistance to help in this situation so you're gonna have to break through that so for your hopes you have the world card you're ready for this to end you're ready for it to complete you're ready to fulfill whatever it is that you need to fulfill so you can move forward and You're hoping that you can get some help by releasing your ego uh, or that you don't have to release your ego just to get help so your strength is the justice card your strength is that you have karma on your side you've been doing what you're supposed to do and the, the universe owes you <laughs> okay your strength is that um, you're going to win you're going to get firm foundations you just need to make the plans there's something that you're ignoring that needs to be resurrected for your own security for your own happiness the queen of pentacles is about making things happen baby okay she makes things happen for her family for her in a loving manner she does it in a loving manner okay so i wouldn't i wouldn't worry because you have it in you to do it you just need to actually do it exactly you need to build that confidence back up in yourself because and tell yourself that you can do it because you can you can okay your weakness is the nine of cups okay um uh, the thing about the nine of cups is being greedy so this is what i'm getting from it i'm getting that you feel like maybe you're looking for too much maybe your expectations are too high um, for your dreams and that could be hindering you so be careful about that you know sometimes you got to take what you got to take okay it's not going to be I, this is what I'm getting. You're just scared that it's not going to be what you want or that it's going to to fall apart. 
a lot of cards fell out so I can't show you them all but um, you need to pause you need to pause take a break look at both sides okay before you make any immediate moves stop reminiscing on the past it's time for you to move forward um, you have been doing too much thinking it's time for you to come out and react you know your truth from thinking and um, you just feel I feel like you feel not good enough right now or you're just you just don't have the energy but you need to move forward you got to do this you got to move you got to get this car you got to get this job so you need to take the reins and move forward six of wands in reverse is your weakness okay and it's like people aren't calling you back It's like people don't see you. You feel like a loser, or you feel like a failure or disappointment. Stop trying to over control the situation. Okay. Exactly. Stop trying to over control the situation. Um, you do feel a di it's like a disharmony with the universe or with yourself. Okay. You need to pause. You need to pause. You need to pause. That's all I'm going to say. It's time to pause before you make a decision. Okay. In your environment, you have the five of cups. The five of cups is an energy of loss. Okay. Um, this is a, this is a very, sad reading but it's really not that it's just that it's like you're paying attention to all the things that are bad so you can't make the decisions because of that um, you do need to realize that you need to be fair to yourself because you've been being fair you've been living if you've been living with integrity and honesty you should be fine if you're not I don't know okay <laughs> it just means that justice will will prevail okay but you have to give you have to give in order to receive that, okay? And just make the proper judgments. Be sure that you're awake, okay? And I say that because when it comes to you, make sure that you're able to take it, okay? Because you've been doing a lot of worrying and a lot of crying and a lot of sadness um, instead of moving forward. And that's causing you to have a disconnect. Uh, I mean, I'm sorry, it was causing you to to disconnect because you're disconnecting from whatever it was that you were in before. And there may be a fire sign involved. Um, what I'm getting from this fire sign is they're not really helping you, they're kind of delaying you. Like they want all of your time and attention so you're not able to give to what you need to give to um, find a, a very loving way to to involve them right and then you can you'll be able to move away from that energy and like away from this emotional imbalance okay with that person okay you end with the four of pentacles the four of pentacles is you trying to hold on to what you've built okay holding on to what you have security success you're trying to make it you're trying to move forward okay with all of the with all of the burdens and all of the things that you have to do you're not making any dumb decisions you're not making any bad decisions you're thinking about everything before you do it because now you have something to hold on to is what i'm hearing patience you were being patient um, you were being open and aware and now things are coming to you. It looks like there wasn't, you weren't getting any messages with the Knight of Swords. Um, it's very, uh like scattered thought you're like oh my god what's happening i don't know what's happening then something new comes in maybe a fire sign comes in for you aries leo sagittarius a younger person um someone comes in with an offer and it seems really wonderful and this uh, this 
it just seems wonderful I'm gonna leave it at that um, it looks like this is the one that you're supposed to take I would take it okay um, you have to make a sacrifice on something though some there's something that you wanted or something that you were looking for that isn't involved in this and you're gonna have to sacrifice that part but it looks like everything is okay you start to heal uh, financially everything is coming together so it ends off very well Capricorn Okay. And that was your reading. I hope that helped you out. Check out the daily readings. Also, I'll see you again for the mid-months. Um, I love you. Love and light. Bye-bye.